Hi dear students, this is Vetri. Today we are going to see about priority queue. Already we have discussed about a normal natural queue and circular queue and all, right? Uh, we all know that what is queue. Queue is a linear data structure that follows first in first out principle. When coming to priority queue, priority queue follows some different set of rules. Uh, we can't compare with the normal queue, natural queue, okay? Uh, like uh, in uh, temple, we will have two different types of queue. In Indian temples, we can see uh, one is for a natural queue for normal people, uh, those who are not reserved uh, that VIP. And another one queue is for only for uh, VIPs, right? So similar way, and uh, we are going to deal the priority queue with this kind of example, okay? See, here, here we have two different types of uh, priorities. First one is limited set of priority and element priority. And what is limited set of priority? So limited set of priority means it will have a, a priority individual. Uh, for example, uh, each element will have uh, different priorities. Uh, this one will have it, it will have high priority like uh, MPs, MLA, and then followed by that. So they are VIPs. They will go directly to the uh, temple and they will. Uh, get served first and then they can uh, come out from the temple as much yearly as they can right so that's the comparison uh, don't get it uh, into too much about uh, the temple comparison okay now what about element priority element priorities which is nothing but it's like a uh, it's their own priority they are creating uh, their priority with that element itself like actors uh, in uh, election, during the election time, we can see that in, uh, in India, the normal people will be on queue and uh, the popular actor or uh, politician or some VIPs, they will go to the election booth directly and they will cast their vote, then they will come out, right? So that's the priority. If uh, he is a superhero, like a superstar, so he will go with the uh, protection, right? So that's the uh, uh, respect for that priority that uh, that celebrity okay because he is a superstar so followed by if he is acted only two three film means so he will have some limited priority and uh, uh, he he won't have that much uh, security for that uh, person then however he will go directly to the bo uh, election booth they will uh, they will cast the vote and uh, they will come out right so that's a simple comparison so there is no politics in it okay now so that's the difference between uh, limited set of priority and element priority, right? Okay, let me explain one by one. First, I'll explain limited set of priority. See here. So for example, I'm going to take the elements A, B, C, D, E, F and priority. Priority of those elements will be like 1, 2, 3, 3, 2, 1. So these are nothing but it's a priority. Let's see how many priorities are there. 1, 2, 3. So which means it having 3 priority type uh, queue. Okay. So here we have three priority. So there will be three queues. Q1, Q2, Q3. So total how many elements? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So array size will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, see, now what about the priority of A, its priority Q1. So in Q1, I'm going to place A. And what about the priority of B, it's going to B. And then what about the priority of C, it's going to 3. And now again, D is also having the priority 3. So I have to place on Q3, Q, okay. Now, 
what about e e is having priority 2 and what about the last one f f is having priority 1 so i am placing f in q1 okay so if i am having some more values means e f g h like that so 2 1 see g is having priority 2 and h is having priority 1 actually how i inserted these values in q these elements in q based on their priority right like uh, reservation system in india for education for uh, uh, employment we are having a reservation system right like uh, oc mbc scst these are the categories right we are having a common test but we have different kinds of reservation based on their um, economical status right so again i am repeating there is no politics just uh, get the point okay now so here i have placed by using the priority right and when it comes to deletion when it comes to deletion i have to take c for deletion i have to follow by the same priority okay so i have to take q1 element first okay because it has the high priority so we can take uh, in reverse order also see i am going to consider one as high priority and followed by two three like that okay so one is having high priority i am going to take q1 as high priority q so i am going to get served first one which, which one will get served first a so a and then what about the next one f and what about the next one h but see here a is the first element no issue but when we uh, trying to delete the next element c 1 2 3 4 5 6 sixth element is going to get served secondly after first see here we have four elements but why it gets served first because of its priority right because they are vip customers okay because they are vip customers so just take the point now next which one will get served first h that's the last element entered into queue but it's going to get served first sorry third okay they are it's going to get served thirdly after the after a and f h is going to get served after that i have to consider the next priority level q2 b e g and then c d so this is how deletion works okay now i hope you understood uh, the logic uh, for a limited set of priority first we have to check uh, how many priority it has okay so here i'm keeping three priority table three priority table so here i'm having three priorities 1 2 3 so if i'm having one more uh, priority means i can take four right so that's it um when we are using uh, this limited set of priority in computers uh, in um, programming in development side so we are using uh, this logic in cpu scheduling uh, we have some methods like round robin and all right so this is also one principle we are following this principle also in scheduling a program in cpu okay now next type is element priority element priority see i'm going to take the elements like Five, six, sorry, five, four, six, eight, three, one. Okay. So here, these are the elements I'm going to deal with. I'm going to perform the operation insertion and deletion. See, five, five. What is the priority of five? I already explained. It it has the one priority. The number, the number has the priority. So which is nothing but five. Priority of five is five. and what about 4 priority of 4 is 4 so same as like that here also i'm going to consider 
the small number small uh, element is going to be having the high priority okay one is going to have high priority and two like that followed by it will have that one priority there is no limitation uh, in the previous model we have a limitation three priority four priority like that right so there will be a different queues for those priority right but here there is no priority it, it has a infinity so there is no queue so we can it can be a group of people in queue and they will have their own priority depends upon their uh, familiarity and their their uh, if uh, like a vip level so they will go uh, go first and they will get served first right like a uh, example like uh, election right so different kind of actors different kind of celebrity uh, they will have different kinds of security and they will have different uh, levels of plan to reach the uh, booth election booth they will cast the vote first and then they'll go out like right okay same so here we have uh, some set of principles to deal with uh, insertion and deletion okay so i already explained that it has their own priority okay so let me explain uh, one by one so first one is first i have to insert all the element in the same order see insert all the elements in same or natural order okay like same which one will come first so we have to enter one by one so we have to insert one by one then for this is one for insertion right for deletion the step is i have to search the element search the elements in the array which has high priority which has high priority okay so after that i have to delete the element okay according to their priority level so let's see i'll do in a diagrammatic way see so what about the size 1 2 3 4 5 6 so so my array has six elements Zero, one, two, three, four, five. let's see first i'm going to insert 5 then 4 then 6 8 3 1 so in natural order so whatever the order i have to enter all the elements in natural order okay after that for this is for insertion for deletion see i told you that i have to search the element which has high priority high priority means the lowest number okay so let's see how can, how, how we can search the element by using for by using for loop we can search the element right for example q of i okay so i have i will compare each element by using like a bubble binary search method those kind of methods now so i will find a uh, uh, one at last position right so i have found the high priority element here and i am going to delete this one okay and then after deletion here i will yeah. okay see next which one has the high priority 3 i am going to delete 3 now so after that again i am going to search all the elements which one has high priority now 5 4 6 8 4 have high priority so like that i am going to delete one by one four and then five and then six eight so after every deletion i have to arrange rearrange the array okay so that's all about the first method so next thing is with here also we have two principles okay so first one is i have to sort all the element i have to insert after uh, in a increment order after sorting the element okay 
so first i have to sort wait insert the elements in incremental order like which means from high priority to low priority okay and then next one is after that i can delete the last element right so that is going to have the high priority right so okay so let me explain so first i have to sort the uh, element which means i am going to find out which one has high priority like that so i can enter like this c okay so which one has high priority here we have to start from the lowest one lowest is known means a big number right so highest priority it will be on last of array okay so which one has high 8 and then 6 5 4 3 1 so i have inserted all the elements right now for deletion so we all know that what about the last position of array that will be having the high priority number okay so which has the high priority he is going to get served first right so first i can delete one and then three four five six eight like that right so that's it that's the whole concept of priority queue I hope you understood the logic very well and uh, just keep the comparison and examples in your mind and it's going to be easy uh, for remembering the logics okay and uh, I hope you understood the logic very, very well and once again I repeat the thing uh, study the data structure with logic don't memorize the thing okay it will be very difficult to handle all the principle in your mind so you have to get uh, into the logic and then understand it deeply Otherwise, it will be very difficult uh, for you people, okay? And thanks for watching. And keep support. If you are not subscribed yet, subscribe now. And thanks for watching once again. Thank you all.